guys, welcome back to Pond Boss. Today we're doing a brand new video. Today's video is all about Ryobi stuff. Uh, I've been having a lot of Ryobi on the channel this year. My uh, my dad and I like to collect Ryobi stuff, so there's a lot of Ryobi stuff that we have. Um, I did my Ryobi Mania video. That's everything I got. There's a few, I think it was like a, about a month ago now, so it's, you know, I've been getting additions. Um, anyways, I picked this up as a bear tool. It's a three-speed hex impact. Um... There's the, here's the, where you put in your bit, Phillips bit, anything like that. Um, Tri-beam LED, got the reverse, forward, and then there's a lock. This thing has 34, 3,400 RPM, IPM, I'm sorry about that, IPM. Um, uh, Three-speed selector right on the back here, there's two, there's three, I'm sorry. Three, and then there's two, and then there's one. So, quite nice for that stuff. For three speed, um, magnet bit holder down here. Down here, there's a bit holder right there. Has to put your screws in or whatever. Eh, that's okay. I don't find it the best, but it's whatever. It does come with a belt, belt clip that you can put on. We don't, I don't generally use that because I find it gets in the way more than anything. So, yeah, quite nice. Um, I'm going to bring in my old one that was in the Ryobi Mania video. Uh, this is what it looks like. Uh, there's quite a difference, as you guys can see. You know, it's a lot more beat up, obviously, but I had that for a few years. They changed this a little bit. This is more like a, a rigid, like, liney one, as you can see. And now the new one's more of a grippy kind of one right here. It's like bumps on it, so you can, I guess it's easier to grab. Um, this, the metal casing here is definitely smaller you guys can see it's definitely this one's pretty long this one's pretty short so it is a see here it's not much shorter i got the backs lined up actually yeah it's definitely not any any shorter it's exactly the same actually um height about the same fun of it Looks a little different, as you guys can see. This is the old one right here. Um, doesn't have any LED light on it, this one. This one's 3200 IPM. This one, 3200 IPM. This one's 3400 IPM. So it's a little bit more IPM than the old guy. Um, on the back, there is, no, there is no speed selector on this guy, the old one. And this one seems to have, like, this is more of a rubber. This has more, like, plastic... Um, plastic it looks like it'd get better cooling so whenever you're using this for a long time it seems like it'd get a lot better cooling this one does have a magnet and bit holder on the bottom so that's kind of nice um same same thing otherwise and um let's put a battery on this actually whenever i had home people i hope just came out with their six amp hour batteries so i picked up a two pack of those i will have a separate review on these things so I will make a review on those, so if you want a more in-depth review, I will make one. So, slap it on the new guy. Whoa, that thing's tall. Holy. Um, so, here it is. Take it off lock first. Now, let's put one on the old one. This thing's really been beaten a lot, so it is getting kind of sparky. So, here, let's rev it up so you can see the spark. kind of sparky in there, but you can hear the difference. So here's full throttle on this one. Now let's do full throttle on the new one. And let's do the speed selector. So this is three. Here's two. Here's one. So, as you guys can see, so, see, three, two, and one. And you basically just hold it full throttle. Two, and three. So, quite nice, quite bright LED, too, as you guys can see. 
plate plate LED. Like I said, I am going to make a, a review on these new high performance lithium plus six amp hour batteries. So I will make a review on that. That's either going to be before or after this video. I haven't figured that out yet. But anyways, I will make a new video on those guys. So anyways, please subscribe if you haven't already and like this video and uh, see you in my next video. Bye guys.